Perchlorates we, we use because, uh, for those of you who are chemists, you've got chlorine there with four pairs of, of uh, you know, shared pairs, and basically potassium chlorate has a spare pair there, and basically we think perchlorate is more stable, but it's not really as good as chlorate for making fireworks. But perchlorates with metal powders are extremely, extremely recent. It's a French word really meaning uh, extremely active and uh, will create these uh, waves from their ignition. And so, just to give you an example of this, uh, I think perhaps, perhaps we will, perhaps can I have the drum again, uh, Alistair? I've brought you a little tube here with just a bit of perchlorate and metal in it. And uh, it's, uh, it, <laughs> we'll leave the lid off. Oops, a daisy. <laughs> Uh, but in here, this little tube here with this electric ignition, there is 0 0.05 of a gram. Now see how little that is? Not very much. Not much at all. But you'll notice that it's a different kind of noise as well. Let's move it a bit that way. Um, <laughs> Uh, it's, it's sharper than the gunpowder bangs. <coughs> you see, it's quite different. <laughs> and, uh, but, but think of the quantity. So small. It's a pinch, if you like. 